What's up guys? Today we'll be playing GTA 4 Online 15 years plus after it was released. And there was like one person at the time I joined the lobby so I thought it was dead. But there, people quickly started to join so turns out there's way more people on it than I thought. Maybe a few dozen or a few, maybe a hundred. But hey, it's easier to find people on GTA 4 than it is to play in some Call of Duties that are way younger, so, yeah, let's do with that what you will, but, like, GTA 5 on the PS3 is way more dead than GTA 4 on the Xbox One, and, well, the thing is, they had backward compatibility, so, and PS4 and PS5 doesn't, or does PS, PS4 doesn't, so that's probably the reason why there's not really any... You know, GTA 5 has two versions. But anyway, GTA 4 on the Xbox One and Xbox 360 and Xbox Series, they all have a backward compatibility. So I think that's what's why it's easy to find players. Anyway, let's just get driving. Driving. Okay. <laughs> and I've actually checked some of these people in the lobby. I checked their gamer scores and their profiles and they're legit. They are not bots. <laughs> Like, some of them had half a hundred thousand gamer score. Like, they had like 40, 50,000 Gs. Some, they at least had a thousand. At least a thousand, 500 to a thousand. So, it's not an Xbox bot. I rarely run into those in this game. But anyway, let's get to it. Let's combine some players and let's cause some havoc. Now, as you can see, you will never have a lobby with like 20 people in it in GTA 4, even on the PS3, Xbox 360. I don't think that'll ever happen again, like having lobbies with dozens of people in it. I just don't see that happening ever again in this game, but you can get quite a few people that aren't your friends, just make friends and stuff. It's crazy. And people, like I said, are more friendly on this game. Like, they'll pick you up in a car. It's crazy. They'll, they're will they actually way more friendly because there's no point in going try hard on a game that's, like, not in the mainstream anymore. You know, that's 15 years old. So, people are just coming on to chill out, play some fun games. You know, GTA 4, the thing I noticed immediately is the controls. They're not, say, different, per se. But the driving is a little bit more, dare I say, realistic. It just has more weight, if that makes sense. I, I, that's the thing I've noticed immediately from when I used to play GTA 4. And it was awesome. Alright, so there seems to be a blockade here. I don't know how I'm going to get through it. But there's a player on the other side. Now let's see if I will get shot on sight. Which I don't think I will. And I think my recording actually corrupted here, but I don't think I will get blown up or anything like that. And as you can hear, the sound did not record. Whenever I try to record GTA 4 gameplay, it just doesn't re It records the gameplay, just not the audio. Maybe because it's a cross-gen game. Maybe because it's an, uh, technically an Xbox 360 game on the Xbox One. And it's just... It just doesn't work. I just can't find a thing. And this is the hacker, by the way. I think it's a hacker, because, like, look at how fast the rockets go, and he probably has a mod menu. It wouldn't surprise me. This game is obviously not moderated, like GTA 5 Online is. And it's a, technically, this could be an Xbox 360 guy, because it's, you know, cross gen, you know, I think. I don't know. But that's what I think. That it they could be hacking because the game is not you know mon moderate like moderated like GTA 5 online because this game is almost 16 years old so yeah I'm gonna drive away from him so I don't get blown to bits and I'm gonna swim back to Los Santos I, <laughs> I'm gonna swim my way back to Los Santos or Cayo Perico because I already committed multiple crimes in Liberty City so I might as well go to Cayo. Or Los Santos. I'm going to go swim back to Los Santos. So, hope you all enjoyed. Peace. Alright, we're going to park our car here. 
just, you know, excellent, excellent parking. Just park right up on the highway. I knew I knew how to drive. I knew I still had it in GTA 4. Like I said, I've played this game for years and... Come on, can I just get out the... No, I have to go off the bridge. I thought I could just drive into the water, but as you can see, the lobby is pretty big now. And these people are not bots, because I checked. And they look legit. Anyway, I'll break my ankles here, and get above this. And there's like a new mechanic, not a new, but an old mechanic in GTA 4 that you could, um, you could strafe. Like, I don't know how to explain it, I'll show you. But anyway, I am headed back to Los Santos. It's gonna take me a little bit, because I'm gonna have to swim there. I'm too poor to rent a boat, or a yacht. So I am going to swim. And we're going to say goodbye to Liberty City. <laughs> yep, bye Liberty City, bye. Oh, that, that looks cool, the sun rising. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed. Peace out, have a great day.